Welcome to IMPW's Daily Devotional Time. Before we start our devotion for today, let's start with a small prayer to align our soul, spirit, and body to receive wisdom and use this time as a transformational moment in our lives and through us to others. Let's start with the word of prayer. Dear Heavenly Father, we come before you today with open hearts and minds, ready to receive your wisdom and guidance. As we embark on this devotional journey, we ask that you align our soul, spirit, and body to be receptive vessels for your transformative power. Lord, we surrender ourselves to you, knowing that true transformation starts from within. We pray that you would cleanse our hearts and minds, removing any impurities or distractions that hinder us from fully experiencing your presence. As we delve into the content of this devotional, we ask for your divine insight and understanding. Open our eyes to the truths you want to reveal to us, and empower us to apply these teachings in our lives. Father, we also pray that you would use this time of devotion to not only transform us, but also to equip us to be agents of transformation in the lives of others. May the wisdom we gain today overflow into our interactions with family, friends, and even strangers, as we seek to share your love and truth. Lord, we thank you for the opportunity to gather together in this virtual space, united in our desire to grow closer to you. We trust that you will meet us here, and that through this time of devotion, we will experience a fresh outpouring of your holiness and grace. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Let's start our day with meditating and hearing from the Word of God from Book of Deuteronomy Chapter 2. Journey with Purpose Let's start with scripture reading from Deuteronomy chapter 2 verse 7. The Lord your God has blessed you in all the work of your hands. He has watched over your journey through this vast wilderness. These forty years the Lord your God has been with you, and you have not lacked anything. In Deuteronomy chapter 2, the Israelites stand on the brink of entering the promised land after wandering the wilderness for forty years. As Moses recounts their journey, he highlights God's constant provision and guidance. This powerful message resonates deeply with our current societal landscape, characterized by rapid changes, uncertainty, and the pursuit of meaning and stability. The Israelites' journey was not merely a physical passage but a transformative spiritual odyssey. They encountered various nations, each interaction teaching them about obedience, trust, and God's sovereign plans. This chapter underscores that their prolonged wilderness experience was a period of preparation and growth, where reliance on God was paramount. Today, our wilderness might be different, political unrest, economic challenges, social upheavals, or personal struggles. Yet, the lesson remains timeless and soothing. God is with us, guiding and providing, even when our path seems uncertain. In Deuteronomy chapter 2 verse 7, Moses reminds the Israelites of how God blessed the work of their hands. In contemporary times, our work environments are fraught with unpredictability. However, recognizing that our efforts are under God's blessing can bring profound peace and motivation. Whether through remote work adjustments or navigating the gig economy, God's provision remains a constant. The Israelites' journey was marked by divine direction a reassuring truth for us amidst societal shifts. Just as they trusted in daily manna, we too are called to trust God for our daily needs and future guidance, aware that He navigates us through cultural and personal wildernesses. The wilderness journey was not solitary, it was a communal experience. In our current cultural context, challenges often push us into isolation. Drawing inspiration from the Israelites, we can build supportive communities, fostering resilience, shared faith, and encouragement. Moses' recounting of the 40 years in the wilderness encourages reflection on God's past faithfulness. Similarly, taking time to reflect on our personal and collective journeys cultivates gratitude. This practice is especially potent in a fast-paced culture that often overlooks the blessings already received. Let's receive our promise from the book of Philippians 4 verse 19 where Apostle Paul ensures the faithful congregation that God who is their creator and redeemer will be with them, and they will lack nothing. And my God will meet all your needs according to the riches of his glory in Christ Jesus. 
God's promise in Philippians 4 verse 19, that he will meet all our needs according to his riches in Christ Jesus, reinforces the message of Deuteronomy 2 verse 7. Just as God provided for the Israelites in their journey, he promises to fulfill our needs in our spiritual and physical walks today. So let's begin our day with a prayer for guidance and blessing, acknowledging God's sovereignty over your endeavors. Seek divine guidance in uncertainty. Whenever faced with a decision, take a moment to pray or meditate, seeking God's direction and trusting in His plan. Build and engage in community. Invest in community life through local groups, houses of worship, or online faith communities. Support and uplift one another. Cultivate a habit of reflection. At the end of each week, reflect on your journey, listing down moments of divine provision and guidance. Share these reflections with others to encourage mutual faith. Promise from the New Testament, Matthew chapter 6 verses 31 to 33. So do not worry saying, what shall we eat? Or what shall we drink? Or what shall we wear? For the pagans run after all these things, and your heavenly Father knows that you need them. But seek first his kingdom and his righteousness, and all these things will be given to you as well. Let's start our day with prayer. Dear Lord Heavenly Father, mighty wonderful God, Lord, we thank you for your unwavering presence and guidance throughout our lives, just as you guided the Israelites through the wilderness. Help us to recognize your blessings in our daily work and to trust in your provision and direction, even when our paths are uncertain. Teach us to build strong, supportive communities and to cultivate hearts filled with gratitude. May we always be mindful of your faithfulness as we navigate our journeys. And thank you for the promise that you will meet all our needs according to your glorious riches in Christ Jesus. We also hold on to your assurance in Matthew that when we seek you first, all our needs will be met. With your promise we step forward in our day with confidence we receive in you through your words. In Jesus' holy name we pray. Amen. May this devotional inspire you to take action in faith and find hope in the midst of chaos. May it motivate you to actively demonstrate God's words through your attitude, words, and actions. May it encourage you to dive into the depths of scripture, allowing it to transform your life and empower you to make a difference in this world. God bless you abundantly as you embrace his promises and live out your faith purposefully and passionately. Amen. Once again, I would like to request you to share this message and subscribe to IMPW channel to receive our daily devotionals and grow according to his counsel and spend your day according to his plan. Have a wonderful and blessed day. Talk to you tomorrow.